friends welcome to top education this session is conducted by surendra singh p and in this session we'll learn financial management unit 2 unit 1 is covered uh, and it is full of theory so no need of explanation it is given okay the video is uploaded so time value of money this chapter is all about time value of value of money so now what is time value of money let's know quickly time value of money is used for investment decision so time value of money is very useful for investment decision if you want to invest in loans the venture shares you have to go through time value of money it is based on the present value of cash for further so it is based on the present value what you are investing now what you will get the uh, after 5 years that difference is shown by time value of money need for a time value of money what are the need why we have to uh, learn this time value of money to create profit guys if you want to invest see for example you are investing in some loans so there you are getting interest also so it creates profit indirectly for expansion of business yes guys now what happens for example i can say lic people are putting in life co uh, life insurance corporation more money like for the students their uh, child the parents their great grandchildren and all because uh, what will happen the next time they don't know so for that they are ready now so here also the investment is done now only for the expansion yes i have to expand expand my business on so and so year so for the expansion of years so more companies reinvestment of money so the money which we have like we have got from the investment we have earned uh, 10000 extra so again we are investing because uh, like we don't need money for our use we have enough of money so reinvestment of money to meet risk and uncertainties as i said life insurance losses accidents in uh, business also to meet the competitions so there are many competitors who are like investing in different securities to make more profits so here we can also invest in this for survival yes guys so here what happens is you will get loss accident and all so here what happens is for survival you need something for 10 more years the uh, invested money can be used here okay now quickly let's know methods and time value of money what are the methods we are using in time value of money first is simple interest compound interest discounting techniques guys in discounting techniques you will have bonds debenture shares see i have written x x etc etc also more things so like uh, you can have annuity method also here annuity method yellarge kotto yakandre we have done in our bcom also and in puc also okay so discounting techniques so in this too you will have simple questions but here more of formulas you have to learn it and guys fm financial management is all about what theory and practical so guys half is theory and half is practical so you have to concentrate on both as well as for example here first and fifth chapter is about theory but what about four uh three and two this chapters are all full of what sums and plus theory a little bit okay so you have to concentrate on all the chapters then only you can clear your this <clears throat> so this page we have done let's move to the next here i have created something called simple interest so here simple interest there is a formula future value and n that will know what is that is equal to p p is the principal amount plus a uh, bracket n into r into p n is number of years r is rate of interest p is again principal amount so here 
two times you will put the principal amount for simple interest this may be asked for two marks not more than two marks i think if they ask they will ask simple interest and compound interest together for six marks okay so let's know how to do this Mr. A, financial manager of ABC Limited, invest surplus fund of rupees ten thousand in an ind in an nationalized bank at ten percent simple interest per annum. How much per uh, how much A will have after five years? So here time value of money. How much he will have after certain period of time? Certain period of time is five years. And see here, Mr. A, financial manager of ABC Limited, invested surplus fund of ten thousand. We don't need yar aunu yen aunu yen bada. Nam yen beko our yes invest madi thare yes percent ke invest madi thare yes year ke invest madi thare. So ten thousand in the national bank bada ten percent saku simple interest per annum. How much he uh, uh like he will have after five years? So years is five years. If more madbutte, his sum will be very easy. So let's see how to do it. So here we have done the for the sum. So F V N means future value is equal to P principal amount plus bracket N is equal to number of years into R rate of interest into P principal amount. So principal amount is ten thousand. Ten thousand, then rate like number of years five years five years, then R rate of return is ten percent ten percent into hundred ten thousand ten thousand principal amount so ten thousand so how how is the formula write down this actually now how we will do is ten thousand into ten percent how much you will get ten thousand. Into ten percent, you will get one thousand. So here one thousand into five, you will get five thousand. So five thousand. So here what happen is we'll uh, do the calculation from left side, no right side. Sorry, right side. Okay. So we'll get the uh, solution very goodly. So ten thousand into ten percent will do. One thousand, so one thousand into five will get five thousand. So we here we have to add it fifteen thousand. So this is the value he will get after five years. Again, we have a next quickly sum. We'll do it. Mr. X of ABC Limited invested fund of twenty five thousand in a financial institution at ten percent for ten years. We need only one, two, three. Let's see how to do it. So we have done it clearly. So as you know, <coughs> so as you know the formula, substitute twenty five thousand ten ten uh, ten years ten percent into twenty five thousand. So what you will do twenty five thousand into ten percent, you will get two thousand five hundred. So two thousand five hundred into ten twenty five thousand as it is twenty five thousand plus twenty five thousand fifty thousand. So guys, in this session we'll learn only this much because. I think we have to conclude this video in this only. So what we have learned quickly, let's know. So financial management unit two, time value of money. What is time value of money, guys? Time value of money means is used for investment decision. So it is very important for investment decision, and it is based on the present value of cash for future. Now, what you value you have, you will get extra value in the future. What are the needs for money to create profit for the expansion of business? Reinvest in money to meet risk and earn certainties to meet competitions for survival. Methods in time value of money we have simple interest and simple interest we have covered. Next we'll cover compound interest and another video will uh, conclude this discounting techniques we have more. This in this like shares, debenture, bonds, and all. So this were the methods of. And here, guys, you have the simple interest, the formula. Don't forget the formula. I think you write down now only the formula. And guys, see the questions. Okay, how we are doing is in from right side we are multiplying. So ten thousand into ten percent, five thousand, one thousand. So one thousand into five, five thousand will get this answer. So 
here also same so guys thank you for watching this video if you like then please subscribe our channel top education and don't forget to share this video to your best friends so thank you guys for watching this video and this video was presented by surendra singh p thank you